What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. We're doing another stipulation draft by Primaris Powerhouse. Draft. You must play every card you draft. You get five vetoes. Primaris, I assume the vetoes mean I don't have to play those cards, right? Because that's the only... Because I can pick whatever I want during the draft. So I assume that the vetoes mean like I don't have to play this card in the deck. 70 bucks is almost enough for a high-quality trash can. Wow. That's true. You could be living the high life. <laughs> you will be back in uh, So you want to open the library here? I think the best card yeah, I think it's yeah. the best card. Card's pretty nuts. You need to control Mike's phone password on purchases, and you can help him save. Yeah, I know. I need to actually uh, password protect his phone. Wow. That noise. Is that chewing? Council's judgment's great. I didn't know council's judgment's in this cube. Me, when Mike talks about spending money and wanting to spend more money and not really getting much for the money he spent so far. Yeah, but what is the... Yeah, but we... Oh, don't do it again, Josh. I Mike's, had this discussion. Mike's put so much, so many hours into the game, and enjoyably so, that like... I think spending 30 bucks on it is pretty reasonable. Anyway. Anyway. Control magic, council judgment. Council judgment? Sounds good. I'll take it. It's like I don't even get a vote. I'm. You're not saying anything. But now you're right. I think judgment is a little better. <gasps> oh! Okay, we get to be this person! Make sure there's nothing else? No, okay. What do you... Nothing else? Nothing else is good as Oko. Just double checking. Uh, what do you? What name a card in this cube that's probably better than Oko? Better than Oko. Oh, I can't. <laughs> okay. Name a card. It in, might actually be the strongest. Name card. a card in modern that's better than Oko. In modern? Yeah. Any ban there? Yes. Well, then it doesn't matter. What's a better card? Uh, a better card in modern. Um, I'm trying to think of a ban card. <laughs> Splinter Twin. Disagree. Disagree that Splinter Twin is better than Oko. What about the Eureka Suspend card? Hypergenesis? Yeah. I don't think I still don't think so. I think Oko wins by itself. You play it on turn two or three. Plains, Swamp, Forest, I think Trilands are pretty good. I mean, we're probably going to end up being lots of colors. Right. So. We get five vetoes. When do we use the vetoes? Can we use them when building the deck? Or Yeah, you. well, that's the only time you can use them because right. we, we draft all the cards. So we're going to have them. a bigger deck too, right? Because it's gonna be it's gonna be over forty cards, right? Well, it's gonna be forty five cards, and we can get five vetoes, so it's gonna be forty cards. So, yes, it's gonna be like a sixty card deck. Well, no, because like we're gonna draft lands. Oh right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we can draft seventeen non basics. That's a lot. What does this one do? Makes a three three for zero. I actually don't hate this one. Um. I consider taking Dismember here. Which member? Dismember. Also, this does set us up to be Abzan. No, it doesn't because we got Oko. No, yeah, I think Dismember is fine. There's no not five colors. Well, I it guess be four. Possible, but we don't have to be red. It depends on the last picks. We're going to end up being one of those things. I guess we can veto those. but That don't impress me much. Got to touch. You know that song? I'm gonna take Night's Whisper. You like Whisper? Oh, boy, you like Whisper? Oh, oh. Take the line Ooh, Triome. Or Fabled Passy. Fabled Passy's better. It just or, gets us all colors. Once Upon a Time's good, too. Oh, Once Upon a Time is actually really good. Dang. I would consider that. I, thought, I like Once Upon a Time. Arcbow's cute, but I don't know how many creatures we're gonna have. Probably a lot, but... Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Do you need an adult? Megalodon tooth, please explain. Frank wants to buy a fossil of a Megalodon tooth. What? Oh, Megalodon tooth. Yeah, so Badger, I found I think I think Command Tooth. So I, I was Mike Mike told me a story about his mom finding like a Megalodon tooth that his dad bought like years ago. And then all of a sudden I was like looking up Megalodon teeth and I was like, these are actually relatively cheap. So, like, I've been looking up Megalodon teeth, and I was like, I was just going to buy one. But then, like, the chat was like, you should make a Megalodon tooth goal for the next goal. And I was like, okay. And then it just kept being memes, so. I think it's here, right? Yeah, I think it is Aramesa. Also, also, Savannah's real good, though. Oh, that, I, we just got Bargain Basement Savannah, so that's good. Bargain Basement. Like your mom. What? Like your mom. What? 
Oh, Sacred Foundry? We're not red yet, but... Shut up and take my money! I could just take Victim. What? Two big teeth bug! <laughs> That's... Wait, why is, is it... Why is it two mana, two one flyer in this cube? Uh, it's aggr That's for the aggressive decks. Enough. Sacred Foundry? Just take Sacred Foundry. We can get it without Mesa. Hmm. This is nine mana. That's a lot, bro. You're gonna die before that. I would rather take wins here. I like wins. Yeah, actually, you're right. Anticipate ain't bad. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Oh, god. I didn't bike. Okay. Is there thunder rumbling or is someone clogged? I don't. I don't hear it. Are you sure it's not your your house? Now we're just gonna take Watley. Really? What was that? What was that? A silent clearing? No, we're just taking all in. You mean taken? Yes. Okay. Okay. What does Watley even do? Boom, 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 yeah, I guess boom, she makes boom, tokens. It's not right, she makes three threes for zero. It's pretty good. Like, they Ooh. have to deal with it. Hobby Bobby. You come out Wooded Foothills? Right now, it gets literally all of our lands. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. It gets all these bitches. Hogak better than Oko? No, no, I don't think so. Hogak is still a build around, whereas Oko is a card you can put in any blue and green deck. Yeah, I think it's Woodfoot Hills. That one's a little close, though. It does make a very generic deck for modern. Plateau seems pretty decent. Are companions worse for modern than Oko? No. No, they're not. They're bad. They're definitely not. I, I don't think Laris is better than Oko. Not in modern, at least. Not Yeah, not in modern. If we're talking about Legacy or Vintage, then I'd say Laris. Yeah, I agree with that. Pateau? Maybe. Maybe we have Sacred Foundry. What are you thinking about taking over it? I and mean, we only have one red card right now, and we have like one, two, three, f three red sources already. I think it's taking. I don't know. No, it's taking already. I like Voracious Hydra actually. Okay. Card's good. It's a nice threat. Oh, stomping around in Misty Rainforest. You only have two blue cards right now. Yeah, one of them is Oko. Yeah, fair point. Yeah, we can take a Misty. I don't think we're really missing on much here. Garrick Primal Hunter's good. Oh. It's three green though. That might be kind of rough. Uh, yeah. It's good though, but stomping around also nice. I like this Tezzeret a lot. Somebody makes a Thopti. Or you can draw a card if you control three artifacts. Draw two cards instead. And then his ultimate doesn't matter because it's never happening. Shut up and take my money. <laughs> wow. That's insane. Badger's too hard. Badger, dude. I like you have a meme goal and you hit it. <laughs> it's unreal, dude. What a fucking... What an actual saint. Oh. Hey, man, God. maybe when you get it, you can resell it for 20k and get it for moving funds. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to do it that quickly, but I also, if I ever sold it, I would just give Badger half. <laughs> Show Badger the meme I made? Which one? Is it a tooth? Oh, yeah. I think he's talking about the tooth one. That one, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. This is how you can tell I saved these. Badger, dude. Oh, my fucking God, man. You are awesome, and I love you, dude. Thank you. That's crazy. That's ridiculous. And it's just, it's not even like, this isn't even like for rent. This is just like, hey, I want this sweet fossil. Always go the tooth? What is What's that uh, card do? This card's interesting. Three mana, three, three, or draw a card for each creature control power three or greater. Seems all right. Sneak attack too, though. We can yeah, still sneak. The targets in here haven't been that great, right? Like there's no Emrakul, right? I don't think. I don't know. Oh my god, Badger, dude. I appreciate you so much. Yeah, let's take City. I'm pretty City's sure Badger, pretty like, 
is responsible for 20% of my life. Well, he's even donated to me before. I think we just take Tyga. Over out city? Yeah, I don't like city at all. I fucking hate I hate cities. I hate lands that dimly damage. And this many colors, though, it's usually worth. Maybe. That's ridiculous, dude. I can't even... Ha I can't even, like... Like... That's not reasonable. I mean, it's totally amazing. It's fucking... I don't even have words. I'm so... I'm so, like... <sighs> I do like Karn. I feel like we should start taking some playables. Playables are all right. Are those are swords. Swords? Oh. Splasher. Mana Confluence is better. Usually they're the same. Unless you have a You're board. right. It's unless you have an Urborg like. I'm just like still like fucking like I can't even like focus right now because this ridiculous badger donation like this card seems good hey RPG uh, badger has a stip I think it's I think he's paid for it <laughs> elf stip only big elves or cards that have elves in the picture or flavor text return. okay deal deal I don't know how possible it'll be but we're gonna fucking make it work wow that's one of 400 stips that I owe Badger. So uh, we're going to slowly... He can basically just request a stip whenever he wants. Oh, yeah. D d dude, it's... Yeah, it's not even close. Okay, I don't know what to take. Take the incendiary flow. Seems fine. So we're buying the tooth on stream, am I right? <laughs> oh, I totally could, yeah. I have to figure out which one to get. Here's the... Go oh, to there's the, a lot of different ones. Go to the site. I'm looking for any of them that are 300 or less. Let me know what you guys think. There's a bunch of different options for 300 or less. There's even a sale going There's on. There's one, right two, there. three, four, five. Yeah, that's why I was so... That's why I was like, yeah, might as well get that. There's like seven available for 300 or less. It's owning a, it's owning a piece of history, you know? It literally is. It's I'm literally owning something that is fucking five million years old. That's insane to me. I just can't wrap my head around that. That's, Wait, what about... Oh. What? I was saying endless one might be better. Maybe. I just don't think we're ever casting a Warped. Why? Triple green, bro. Who cares about that? I do. No one cares about you. Wow. You take that back. No. I'll never do that. How much do stips cost? Uh, usually it's 35. 35 is my default. Like, if you guys if you guys want to do less or if you guys can't handle 35, it's totally fine. You're the second one who said the bargain one. Why the bar? Why, why that? How come that one? That one does look good, actually. I like the, like, little lacerations on the other side interesting was it the bargain one? Oh, because it's on a sub 200 it also says bargain oh. in the name um questing beast seems great we're definitely base green he black and pointy <laughs> badger's like i want for the aesthetic i do kind of prefer the black ones just go outside grab a rock that's probably around 500 million years old oh fuck you know it's got a point I know it's awkward I don't want to admit it shut up and take my money what happened I care about Mike Buck <laughs> <laughs> oh god and that was how I died this is like the last elf we need the colorless tapping elf Here's an I, I care, care about, about Mike Buck. Oh god, I think it's Waterlog Grove. Because we have a good amount of blue and green. I, I thought I wanted. Oh, I like Dream Trawler a lot. It's got to be Dream Trawler. Now right? it's uneven. Oh god. Oh I god. Do it. <laughs> oh god. It's happening. Uh, let's look at sort by color here. Two red, a couple of white. We're mostly. Obviously, mostly green. Um, it might just be Unesh. 
think it's like great though. I think we probably just want some more removal. Like a wild slash. Probably disfigure. Unish, 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 unish. I'm gonna take this. That's to the tune of Jolene by was that Dolly Parton? Is that Dolly Parton song? You don't know, man. Guys, the literal next goal is just gonna be the security deposit for my new place so I can afford to live. I'm fucking amazed that we hit this meme goal in like a day. Badger, you are a goddamn saint, dude. Saint Badger. Man, I need a stream. So I can get that shark tooth money. <laughs> Mike's like, that's all I ever wanted in my life was was a shark tooth. I'll make it a goal every month and then I can have ten of them and I can make a necklace. Or you can just put them in your mouth. You can have, go to the doctor and have them implanted in your mouth. Uh, I and then you can just walk around with a mouthful of shark teeth. You just get mouth, you get bigger fucking mouth. Your mouth is so oh tiny as God, is, though. I, so, I fucking knew you were going to do that. So, like, it makes sense, I guess. I think there's ultimate prize here. A day took RPG Badger five minutes, yeah. Yeah, Badger's like, hey, guys, what's up? Got a gold? Cool. Here you go. See you later. Bye. Jolene's song at half speed on YouTube is actually... Oh, really? I've actually seen that. It's great. Oh, that sounds interesting. Oh, Forest Island Mountain? We should remember that and watch it. It's pretty interesting. So you can just watch the regular Jolene video and just to just speed it down, right? <gasps> yeah. Farseek can hit the friggin' Trilands. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. I think even if it couldn't, Farseek would still be the pick. Well, no, wait, hold on. This is a forest, and this is a forest. So Nature's Lore actually hits two of them, and it comes into play untapped. Wait, does that work? Search your library for a forest card, put it on the battlefield. Oh, they come into play tapped anyway, so yeah, never right. mind. We'll just get the far seek. Oh, Woodfall Primus? Are we going to be that big? Could, all just be, could also just be domestication. Badger, nice. I open this. Oh, so it's it's 33 RPM slowed down. So I you can just watch this at normal speed, and it'll be it's already slowed down. Right. Okay. I don't have chain lightning, just some early removal stuff. Oh, we already got like ultimate price cast down and cindery flow. Fair enough, yeah. Winds, council, dismember. I feel like we're okay with that. All right, cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna listen, I'm gonna pause the recording and listen to this after this the draft portion. Oh, Choops? Oh, that's nice. Choops just kills everything. Eh, I like languish. Even your father. At least I have a father, Michael. I do too. It just doesn't work. Oh, fertile ground? Oh, that's fertile in ground? Perfect. Fertile ground? Perfect. <clears throat> oh, disfigure came back. <clears throat> disfigure came back. You could disfigure me. Uh, what? Don't. That's actually. Ah, hey, Wolf Strider's good. Not bad. This deck's looking all right, man. All right, and the goal, because fuck, God, it's ridiculous. Denver house security deposit. Security. I like a merfolk looter. Pacifism. Oh yeah, that's that's actually pretty good. So. What do we say? Fifteen hundred. So like seven fifty would be half of that. <clears throat> no, wait. I thought the security deposit was equal to the rent, right? It is, but not for me. Thank right? you. Right, like my share isn't. What do you mean? Because I'm not paying for the. Because the security deposit is thrown down because the the, the um it's twenty two hundred a month. Mm -hmm. No, yes. Twenty two hundred plus the one hundred dollars divided by three, so it'd be like seven sixty six. Ah, okay. T. Ravis, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. And we'll just do this till the end of June. Yeah, I'm just done. I was like, just twenty two hundred. Right, but I'm like, because that's not what I'm paying. Right. That's not my share. Be a lot cooler if you did. That would be a lot cooler <laughs> if I did. Okay. Okay. Yeah, making those kind of stream bucks yet. Now I have now I have a real goal that sustains me rather than a, a fun meme goal that Badger just chooses to hit because he's a absolute he wholesome creep. maniac. Okay. Um we can one, two, three, four, five. This is only six cards here. <clears throat> so we can veto all of these and play one of them. We only have eight creatures. I think it's probably Languish. And then we play these. Uh -huh. And now 
we have to add five extra cards. Well, probably like lands. Yeah, probably like six. That'll make us seventeen lands, right? Yes, but you don't want to have seventeen lands and forty-five cards. So you want to have like two extra lands. Look at all these artifacts we're not playing. This is four artifacts we're so not we playing. So we play nineteen lands, you think? Shut up and take probably my nineteen. Or 20. One secure buck. Love it. Kurt, I love you, buddy. Are stiffs back up right now? What do you mean? They've always been up, buddy. I ain't never taken them down. Yeah, we're oh, are worse. they backed up? Oh, no, not really. I got, like, two in the queue. But, I mean, like, I'll get to all of them before the before the cube's down. And if there's ever too many, like, there's always more cubes, so. He's right. There's always there's always a, a I higher. I added an extra card to the deck. That's what you think. Yeah, you added an extra card to the deck. Which one is it? Tell me what it is. I have no idea. It's the Ancestral Blade. Get oh. wrecked. Sort by color. Yes, this is a stipulation draft. So the stipulation was that we had to uh, draft all the cards, but we get five vetoes. So every card that we drafted, we had to play a sub five. This is definitely a, uh, we need a, a mana help. White, blue, black, red, green. Looks like we're mostly black, green. It definitely looks like we're mostly black, green now, yeah. Okay, so white sources and mana we have. <coughs> uh, one, two, three. Isn't that four? No, because this is a oh. teamer. One, two, three. Does Misty get anything? I think so. Yeah, it gets Temple Garden. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, also two, gets three, three, four. Oh, you're right. Five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's plenty of white. <coughs> also, uh, like, it's so funny because all of the fetch lands almost get every color now because of the tri lands, which is pretty bonkers. Uh, black, blue sources. Arid Mesa for sure gets one of these. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, black sources. We have. I Yeah, you get the Abzan one. One, two, three. Yep. Four. four. Mm -hmm. Five, six, yep. <coughs> God, fetch lands are so good with the tri lands. It's unreal. Red, we have one. <laughs> wow, Kerr, that's amazing. Two stips in the clip and one in the hold. Mike <laughs> B's about to make some bodies turn cold. <laughs> Is that the... Yeah, you're good. I think. One, two, three, and three, and four. Is that the same song? Yeah, I think so. Two and the clip. One and the hole. Yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> anyway, doesn't matter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight red sources. That is overkill. Green, we have, oh, God, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <clears throat> well, that's good. All I right. And <clears throat> we get to add like seven lands. <clears throat> Uh, no white, for sure. We do not need any more white sources. I can agree with that. Blue. Uh, we could probably use at least one. I'm going to say two because we've got a lot to work with. Black is probably three. Green is probably two. No, that's seven. We'll say one green, one red. A red? Why? I don't know. We don't need a red we at need, all. We definitely don't need a red. We have two red cards and they're Jeez. both single reds. Actually... We can just add a third island. Well, we don't have that many blue cards. But we do have... We had three double blue cards, and we want a blue three? early for... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we, this would be 9, 9, 9, 8, 10, which I think is real good. Yeah. Seems and it gives us a friggin' 47-card deck, which is hilarious. So three blue, three black, and one green. 47. This is 19 lands... This is going to be wild and crazy. <coughs> Plus, we do have uh, we do have Farseek and Fertile Ground to help us with mana, which is pretty sweet. So, And our curve is looking good. Oh, man. I'm hoping we win with this deck, dude. This deck looks sweet. Magic players mount up. <laughs> Magic players! 19 lands sounds low. I don't know, man. 40 card decks has 17. We're playing five more. So we added two lands. That's yeah, we have five extra cards and two extra lands. So That's still like 
basically 33 more percent, right? Yeah, about half of the cards we added, a little less, like a little less than half are, are lands. So I think it's just, it's totally fine. I think we'll be all right. You can maybe argue 20, but you know. maybe you can. I'm gonna keep this open so I can quickly. And despite being 47 cards, this deck does seem pretty cool. It's got some great cards in it. You can never count on the 3-0, though. <coughs> yeah, it's a bit of a pile, but what are you going to do? This deck is not a pile. Who said that? It's forty-seven cards. It's, it's that doesn't. I mean, that doesn't make it a pile. Kind of close. What if I'm okay? So what if I'm playing? No way. Fucking Yorion decks have four. Have eighty cards in them, man. Deck size. Do we keep this one land and we can far seek? It also is a any color land. Which I'm gonna keep it. it. More tempting. <clears throat> Are we in the play or the draw? On the draw too. Okay. If we're on the play, that would probably be too greedy. Our opponent's like. I got 47 lands and 47 cards in your deck. Uh, oh, oh! I was like, please don't. Just oh, that was so up. good. Try home! Yeah, baby. Oh, I didn't even care which one it was. Oh, that's so I was good, dude. Grass now. Wow, that was good. <clears throat> Once upon a time means our deck is basically 46 cards, Michael. You're not actually wrong. Hold on, Kerwich just asked for the houses we're looking at. There's a few. Or are you just sending the one that we're thinking about applying for? Yeah. Yeah, I like that one. It's hundred bucks, a lot more than hundred bucks cheaper a month. Yeah. And, and it, it looks, looks real nice. Yeah. yeah. It looks just as good as the other one, honestly. Also, the living room is real big, which is nice. I miss that about our old place. Are you far seeking? Two triumphs and a mana confluence. Two triumphs on the board and a confluence in the hold. That's not as good. Uh, just to be clear, we can cast our Vorpede now because of all the greens. Are we playing our Vorpede? <clears throat> Fuck yeah, we're playing it. That's a great threat. Fuck yeah, we're playing it. Oh. 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 Wow, they're just drawing cards. I mean, at worst, we can play Woast Rider or Night's Whisper. What uh what what date does Katie have to move out by? July. Like she's got time. We could actually stay through all of June if we had to. Well that's awkward because then the house might be gone, right? Right. Yeah. Um do we just want a night's whisper here? To guarantee we hit for Hwatley? I kinda do. Yeah, I mean, us waiting longer would be better for me, but we got to do what we got to do. So, well, we don't. We can just move out the third week. Like, it's, I was just trying to do it because I'm just want to be like settled and done. You know, it's just the longer I can stay at my job and make a little more money, the better. Well, that's pretty cool. Cool, cool, cool. Well, we do get to council's judgment that thing, because like <clears throat> even extending it out another week means that my last paycheck will be like a full paycheck. Okay, which would be nice. So. Well, we can just leave you back here. Wow. No, that doesn't work, Dan. I was just gonna say, realistically, that could work because you could just drive now and you're done. But oh wow! Oh, I wish I had one more land so I could Oko and Council's Judgment. But as it stands, hey, whatever house you guys get, check the drain and make sure they work well. Legit, the worst thing about my place. The drain. Interesting. Interesting. I never had drain issues. Usually I do sometimes, but like I'll just get a plunger and plunge them out. And usually that solves the problem. Like, do you get to cash out any PTO? No, because I don't have any left. They only give you um, two days of PTO unless you've been there for, uh, you don't get any more until another six months. Which I will not, I'll be shy of six months by quite a bit. Also, I don't know if they pay out PTO at all. I can PT forever. Well, we can play around Mana Lake and... That sucks, like, yeah, for sure. 
Oh, dang. It'd be nice to get an extra two days of pay, but what are you going to do? I got sick, and I just couldn't work. And this was before working at home was a thing, so I couldn't um, He got that He got sick. More like Gambler took over for that week. Dude, that was before I was even playing poker with us. <coughs> oh, I didn't listen to Jolene. Dang it, I totally forgot. <laughs> no, we did forget. We can do it in between matches. I was so interested in the mana bases. Oh, really? That's interesting. We give 120 hours the first year. Yeah, that's... I mean, I like the job I work at, but, like, it doesn't pay enough. And and also, I, it, I can't really... I can't afford to make that in Denver. It's not enough money. And uh, their PTO could be better, but once you get another six months, I think they give you two weeks or something like that so it's not that bad or something like that I forget the exact oh that's really good that's actually going to yeah. be a bit of a problem that's pretty good that's Ooh, what's known as the perfect no answer one. KFC screwed up my order but it was still delicious I can't wait forever green two three Four and red. Did I say two weeks? That's not what I meant. My bad. Why would you lie? Why you gotta lie, Craig? <coughs> so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can actually crack this because we don't have any creatures more than seven. Shut up and take my money. Oh. Hopefully this is how we do it for a step. I'll email it to you. Yeah. Dockery, that's totally fine, buddy. Appreciate it, my dude. Colorado's law makes it so PTO is paid out on you leaving, so save some there if you are moving. Doing oh, real, that's a good idea. I didn't know that. Doing real good. What? Apparently in Colorado, it's a law that if you still have PTO, they have to pay it out when you leave. Colorado? Yeah. That's pretty good. It's nice <coughs> to know for the future. Rocket Mountain High, Michael Biscuits. <coughs> is that, do you like that? Michael. Yeah, great. Oh, we got a language here. Wow, that Oko is real good. It's almost as good as our Oko. One Mike B. If you have any HR questions, I can always help. It's good enough. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Oh boy. Boy, boy, boy. Boy, boy, boy. Boy, 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 boy. I wish any of these killed planeswalkers. <clears throat> they don't. They do not. They do not. I also wish I played Oko and made the goat a 3 3. That would have been real good. Did I miss my own donation? I guess you did. No, I saw it and I responded. I said, Dalkery, thank you. And then so I said, said, Did I miss, not you? Oh. Shut the fuck up. Wow. Got him. Sorry for correcting you. I don't forgive you. Dang. I don't want to languish because then I just make two more guys and then turn one of them to elk and then we're just... I wish I slept less. Why? Because now I'm hungry. <laughs> Why don't you just eat breakfast like a normal human being? Because <clears throat> I slept till two. Why can't you just eat food when you wake up then? I didn't have anything and I wanted to join the stream. and It'll be alright. I can be hungry for a little bit. Michael's like... Oh yeah, intermittent fasting is a good thing. I was doing that for a while. I should probably do that again. That's what I've been doing. <clears throat> I've been going from noon to ten, which they want you to go eight hours and sixteen hours, but it's just it's harder on my schedule. Yeah, how does it work exactly? You're supposed to like you eat if you eat for eight hours a day, and then you then you fast for sixteen. Okay, so your window of eating is only eight hours. Right. So if you eat at noon, you can't eat later than like eight, or if you want to eat at like ten a.m., you can't eat later than six. So mm, that is kind of rough. It is rough, which is why I'm trying to do ten because like usually I'll I'll try to eat I'll eat dinner at like nine, right? So I'm trying to like but then I don't eat again until like at least noon or one the next day. That's rough because of the time I wake up and the, the way my schedule works. Just gotta just gotta deal with it, Michael. Michael Biscuits. 
Also, I imagine if you internet fast wow, for 15 good. hours instead of 16, it's probably still good for you, right? I that's mean, what I'm thinking. I'm like, I feel like the the fasting itself, like the, the, the hour difference, yeah, it can't be that, that big of a deal. Yeah. Okay, I have no idea how we're gonna win this game because Oko is just unbeatable. Like, unless you have a way to deal with Oko, like a straight up way to kill it, <clears throat> like you just can't win. I think Oko is a big mistake in this cube. Yeah, he seems super overpowered compared to everything else. Right, agreed. Like it just seems like he just. I don't think there's any card that's even close to his level of goodness. Right, I have three removal spells in hand, and like I just so can't deal with Oko. Nothing. Also, I don't think there's that much removal for Planeswalkers in the cube. It doesn't seem like it. Where even this is like, okay, cool, they make two one ones, big deal. But like, I just can't deal with this piece of shit. Like, there's like Hero's Downfall, I guess, in here. Yeah, the, but the other problem is Oko just he gets like he starts at six, so he just gets so out of hand. So like, Burn never works either. One more night. It's probably the best card in this cube. It's an Aeroflow? No. No, no. Like, next turn, they're talking for two, four, five, six, seven, and it's just really good. Mm -hmm. All spending no resources. Right. They literally just took our Oko like four turns ago. <clears throat> 18 6. Jesus. Good gravy. I was on a different screen and the stream was paused. That's actually pretty hilarious. I'm going to donate, but I'm not going to watch it happen. You can do the super extreme diet where you just eat once a day. That's rough, though. Although, I guess I'm going to do it today, but whatever. I love how Rage gives you notifications like, you have full energy, don't waste it. Yeah. Oh, okay, I'll go back. Well, the thing is, energy, um, it renews itself every couple minutes. Right, so if you don't actually so you spend don't it, it, you're, you're just capping out. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we're just basically dead here, right? Losing value. But uh, as much as I like Raid, got to do something else, man. <laughs> you? Can't just always play Raid, you know? You don't have to... Yeah, tell me about it, Mike. Tell me. Tell me about it, Michael. Michael, tell me. I'm just attacking Oko, who's at 11. It's it's annoying because like they have these in-game events and ch and tournaments and stuff where it incentivizes you to play more. Mm -hmm. Like those don't cost anything. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But if you're not if you're not keeping up, you know, you, if you're not first, you're last, Frank. Buddy. Although, by the way, that that tournament that's going on. Yeah. Uh, I have like over a thousand more points than the next person. So it's not even close. So you're basically gonna win. I'm gonna win for sure. Oh, they're gonna counter this. But if I can get, if I can get like 300 more points, I get a free five star chicken. I love a five star chicken. <clears throat> That's super valuable. One. Are they logic nodding us? Are they just letting it happen? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um. I was gonna say something. Was. Oh, have I seen Frozen too? I haven't seen either of the Frozens. I have not seen Frozens either. Maybe you should just let it go, Michael. That's why my brother does intermittent fasting. He's lost 100 pounds in a year. God dang. Yeah, I should probably do that. It seems pretty easy to do, right? Um. Oh, God. Dream Trawler seems friggin' beautiful here. White, white, blue, blue. Oh, got to play the land, though. Questing Beast could be very, very good. Chickens are pretty hard to come by in this game. True. <sighs> What's better? Oh, they have an Oko. I guess I'm taking the trawler. Unless they got hexproof, bro. It don't really matter. It's a three three, is what it is. You like them six mana three threes? Yeah, it doesn't even keep flying. You're gonna counter that? Why even counter it? That just seems like a waste. Well, it's got. It, I have to discard a card to give it hexproof. <clears throat> oh yeah, my bad. I mean, I don't even care about the Elspeth. They'll just keep it on board. Yeah, if you kill it, that's worse because they can reanimate it. Mm 
you get silver and you're like, no one lost ahead of you. You're the first loser. <laughs> oh man, Seinfeld's a treasure. One more mic. Why didn't they, they could have pumped this and killed us this turn. That's pretty good that they didn't do that. Interesting choice, interesting choice. I'm going to make an emblem with my Gidgen. Because just in case you have some weird combo, it'll never happen. I can never lose. Hmm. You know what's better than three Gideons? One four. Loco. I thought you were going to say four fat chickens. <laughs> Give me your meat. Well, only if they give me their Four meat. fat chickens riding down the street. Give me just a one more night. My name's Michael Biscuits. <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? I don't know. Do you need Jesus? Yes. Oh, they didn't even try to Oko, my guy? <clears throat> I guess they're just going to... Supreme Verdict. Cool. Hmm. If they didn't have Fractured Identity, I feel like this game would not have been close. Yeah, they won basically because they had Fractured Identity. Although everything else they played was Irrelevant. pretty unimpressive, yeah. They literally... Our, our, our Oko was the best card in their deck. Yeah. True. That's for true. Got a golden ticket. Just side out all your good cards. I'm Sorry. about to get on the fat train? What does that mean? Well, it sounds good for foods later. I was going to make pasta, but I want to go to the store and get uh, some impossible sausage. Beyond sausage? Which one is it? Beyond sausage. So if you want to go, if you want to go out and grab something, I'll go with you and go to the supermarket. We could do that. What time do they close? I probably gotta go to Lee's because the Smiths didn't have it. I think they close at eight, but closes at ten. Mm, I doubt that's accurate. You want to give them a ring? See what time? Would sure. you mind? Board out Oko for spine thought. I mean, we're still never doing that. Are you ready? What the numbers? Four three five. Seven five five. Four five one zero zero. Just be like, what time you guys close? Thank you. I would have never figured <laughs> that out. You gotta ask them what time they close. It is a two mana two one flyer. It's a Mistral Charger. Recording to 10 p.m. Hmm. Yeah. It is a Saturday. I'm gonna ask a person just in case. That could be it. It's a good idea. They might have just uh, not changed the recording. Yeah. Really? We drew all three swamps. Seriously. Do you guys have veggie burgers? <laughs> Y'all have veggie burgers? I'm asking for a friend. Well. Four fat chickens. Oh yeah, I was just curious what time you guys close tonight. Okay, thank you. Yep, 10. God damn. Not that we're going that late, but. You don't know. Hey, man. I want to eat before 10 p.m. I think that's pretty reasonable. I think you're being a little baby right now. Wow. <clears throat> Winds of my bacon? What should I get, though? I don't know. Some kind of bullshit. I'm just getting a little C's. Snap it off. That's pretty good. Mike B is so polite on the phone. Yeah, I've done a lot of customer service, so. I tend to fall into that. 
mindset. He falls into it. He also falls into the gap. Middle Seas Man, 11 bucks, two meals. How do you beat it? It's going to go to the next I game. I can't play games. anything right now. It's unfortunate. I mean, that would let me play. You should do call support, Mitchell. I've done call center work plenty. Um, my next job is probably going to be a call center. So, All right, let's play the next match. Oh, man. If you guys haven't done so, definitely go to Google and search for Dolly Parton Jolene 33 RPM slowed down digital version. It is wild. It does not sound like Dolly Parton at all. And it sounds real good. I, this is one of my favorite memes. This is not okay. It sets a dangerous example and we need to talk about it. If you punch a Nazi like this, you're going to break your wrist. Remember, make contact with the two largest knuckles and keep a strong wrist. You want to hurt the Nazi, not yourself. Stay safe out there and keep punching Nazis. <laughs> yeah, see what's happening right here. This is where it's because it's like you're kind of pushing up where you want to like connect here and you want to be careful where your thumb is so you don't break it you know, don't, yeah don't do this you know katie's a big fan of tucking the thumb in oh no that not when she punches just in general oh, okay let me say that you can break your thumb doing that we need to hear the rat train at 33 rb oh my god should i slow it down send them on down to rat train i'm gonna keep this hand any green is good have we have nine green sources got to call on the rat train <laughs> Yeah, don't be tucking the thumb, man. What is this? What are you sending over here? Chipmunks on 16 speed. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yes. Jesus. Dude, hold on, hold on. That's not chipmunks. Okay, hold on. Oh god, they're doing some stuff. Covered by chipmunks, then slowed down. Oh, okay. What? That's wild. I'm just pacifying this guy because I don't really need this dude to be coming at me if they play a big, big fat daddy. A big, big fat daddy. You know what I'm saying? Name one original chipmunk song. I dare you. I don't know the band, so I couldn't. Oh, that's a nice. Does father like Big Fat Daddy? <laughs> what is that? Boy, mean? does he ever. This is what father likes. We could fertile ground on here and then play Sylvan Library. We could also turn this Brimaz. If four Oka can go to six, we could turn Brimaz into a three three. They attack for four. Oka Oka goes down to two. Hmm. I don't know how we're dealing with this guy otherwise, but I think it's actually just fertile ground. Into Sylvan Library so we don't... Okay, just checking to make sure we didn't... Call me. Online. You can call me any, any time. I wonder what would happen if you sped up a Johnny Cash song. Hmm. I don't want Fertile plus Seek because then it leaves us with only Oko in hand. I want to have options to play other things. And I think... Yeah, plus Farseek like, can shuffle for us, which is relevant. Yeah, Farseek is also puts us to six mana. And, I, I, like, five mana is all we really need to function in our deck. So, I'm not too concerned with the extra land. I'd rather have an option of, like, being able to deal with the cards they have on board so far. Yeah, we have literally one six drop, so... What is it? <clears throat> Dream Trawler? Yeah. Dreamy T? You, oh, hey. you set up. If you sped up, I hurt myself. Doctor, I did get your email. Yes. The cover that Johnny Cash did of Nine Inch Nails. Mike did not see your email because he doesn't have access to my personal email, though. That's what you think. Shit, buddy, I know all your secrets. Do you? Oh, Choops is great. We can kill the the fat daddy. Also, I love that that song. It's great. What? I hurt myself today. 
or it's just pain, called it's, pain, yeah. it's actually just called it's just called hurt is it hurt or is it pain it's not pain it's called hurt no oh, close enough <laughs> just thought someone was going to hurt myself today <laughs> that's just funny to me it's just funny to me on your thoughts on your boy biden and he's your <laughs> biden's not really my boy i don't know why you're calling him my boy is he better than Trump? Yes. Will I vote for him over Trump any day of the week if I have the option to? Yes. I'll vote for a ham sandwich over Trump. Interesting. Arguably the best cover, cover song ever done. Yeah, I really like it. I think it's definitely better than the original. What's it doing right now? <clears throat> What's happening? Briarhorn. Never saw that before. Just because Cash's voice is insane. <whistles> Six mana. So we can go Judgment Oko. It's not great. Go Looter Oko. You gotta do something. Uh, Making food's not terrible either because of the life. I guess. Let's get a green here. No, that's a white. Yeah, I need, that's what I meant. Okay. Shut up, Michael. They have one card in hand. Frank, listen to the link I sent. One, two, three, four, five damage. Six, seven damage. I don't care for any of the presidential candidates. Give me Captain Crunch. <laughs> He's a true hero. I'd vote for Captain America. Steve Rogers has my vote. Oh, we go to seven, three, four. Three, four, five, six, seven. Yikes. Yep, I think we're dead. It's not looking good. Yeah. Remember when people voted for a dead gorilla? I don't understand that. Reference. Captain America definitely would not do that. There's, there's actually like no evidence whatsoever that that would be the case. That's hilarious that you'd say that. <sighs> so we play this, make a food, we die. Hmm, that's unfortunate. We transform the god into an L. Yeah, Captain America is definitely about equality. That actually could work he always comes off to me as a secret conservative i don't know man i think no he's pretty he, what that's insane make sure this doesn't fall off <coughs> let me lose oko though that's pretty fucking bad i guess it's better than dying gamble or for president 2024 I'll get you. The old gambler. Yeah, I mean, like, we lose Oko. Oko is always better for our opponents. It's pretty funny. They take ours and kill us with it, or we just play ours and it dies immediately, so. God, no, we're well. just too far behind. It's not really Oko's fault. He comes from a time when being a patriot didn't mean you're an asshole, exactly. Yeah. Oh, I know. Everyone knows about Harambe, but I didn't know people voted for him. That's crazy. Maybe economically, but their human rights decisions would dominate Steve's decisions. Oh, they're just exactly. going yeah. face. Fascinating. Languish on the tip of the top. I just want to see it. One, two, three, four. No. Okay. It's one, two. One, two, three, four, five. So we block here. One, two, three, four. Let's go to green. Let's go seek and far. Oh, I think we're dead. 
We're fucking dead. Yeah, this game's stupid. Wait, Waldo, that doesn't... Did you type that wrong? That doesn't make any sense to me, that sentence. How does that make sense? Conservatives and fear are highly correlated. People who feel lots of fear, usually physical, heavily lean conservative. Okay. Right. Captain America doesn't feel much fear, so he's less... Oh, less likely. Yeah, you just have I to read, read all I, the words I, I in a sentence. Wrong. That's your weakness, reading all words and sentences. You just kind of skip over and you're like, I'll read three. It's got seven words. I'll read three of them. <laughs> and then I'll be like, I don't understand. How come it doesn't Well, it's not I didn't read it. It just like, it didn't process in my brain correctly. Because you didn't read it. Maybe if your brain wasn't broken. Okay. It's round two or round one? Round, or round three, rather. Round two. All right. We can still win this. Like he's from the forties, he's probably fiscally conservative, but he's most he's most liberal when you can imagine and everything else. Yeah, that's probably about correct. I appreciate that you guys are taking my terrible take seriously. <laughs> Steve Rogers is a treasure. That was a terrible take, you goddamn son of a biscuit. Steve Rogers is a fucking treasure. No misunderstanding slash representative of conservatives is too much for me. I'm off for now. Have a good one, my dudes. What happened? Dang. Um, I think we're just woe stridering. Oh, we could have Wolfier Silverhearted too. That would have been good. Dang, I should have Wolfier Silverhearted. Any chance we could keep the politics out? I would fucking love that. But one person asked me a question and literally never said anything else after I answered their question, so. Kind of weird, but alright. Weird flex, but okay. Scroll down, bro. That's it. You're at the bottom. <clears throat> Lots of W's. Nah, brah. Make your little wolfy boy. Put on a happy face. I think there's far too few answers for planeswalkers in this cube. Eh, maybe there's not. There's like banishing lights and stuff, but I still get it still feels like if you get a planeswalker down, like it's just not good. Like it's just hard to deal with if you don't have if you don't have an answer, like it just If you love to keep it out, just don't answer those questions then. Well, it was about Captain America. It wasn't really a serious discussion. No, it wasn't the question. Also, yeah, it wasn't a question. It was like a statement, right? No, that wasn't the question that led to this is my point. Oh. I mean, this feels like languishable, but then they just keep Gary. Gary! Don't they keep Gary either way? Well, yes, but we also don't have double black, so I'm just going to pretend it's not an option. <laughs> Mike, top three favorite superheroes go. Uh, Flash. He's definitely up there. Probably He's just going to name all the CW characters because that's all he knows. Not true. I really like Flash. I we liked Flash way before CW. No, he didn't. <clears throat> You're a liar. <laughs> I actually read a few Flash comics before that show came out. Well, like three? Know. Well, I read the, uh, what's the big event? It's called, um, I can't think of the name of it. Uh, Chickenberg? No, the one where he goes back Chickenberg to Chickenberg expansion? To the, save his mom, what's the, the name of that timeline? The Chickenberg Paradox? <laughs> well, there's Paradox in it, I think. But anyway, yeah. Uh, Flash... Let's see who else. 
Spider-Man's pretty dope. Huh. Probably Batman. For the last one. I feel like we're just losing the Planeswalkers. Does this child at least have stuff like Pithing Needle Sorcerer? I think there's a Sorcerer Spyglass. You got a star going now. Flash, Luke Skywalker, and SpongeBob. Well, hmm. Flashpoint, yeah. yes, that's the name of it. Batman's something of a scientist <clears throat> himself. Oh, what? Oh, I see. Ma Frank, has Mike ever flashed you? Wow. Yeah. It was disgusting. <laughs> disgusting! I know it was fucking one of you's. Oh yeah, Cyclops is the absolute <laughs> fucking worst. Oh yeah, he's <laughs> he's pretty bad. He's just a terrible human being. Cyclops is the biggest shitbag. Cyclops killed Professor X, bro. That's among one of his things that he's done. Disgusting. You hear that dog? I hear him. He's having a good old Barkums. We need a second black. We probably also need a second white. There's an alternate universe Scrubland. where the Flash Perfect. likes to flash people. Hmm. Oh, we don't have a red source? Oh, God, we're terrible at this game. He's in a polyamorous relationship with Wolverine and Jean now. I'm not up on the current stuff. If that's true, don't don't be spoiling. That seems real weird. Michael B lives up in the trees. It is Michael B. The Aquaman character in The Boys likes to flash people. That is true. Boy, The Boys is so good. It was very, very good. I can't wait till the next season. Till the next episode. One, two, three, and till the four. One in the boys. Do you want me to tell you if it's true? I will if you want me to. No. No. Spoilers, bro. Pretty sure 50% of Seattle is at a polyamorous. I agree with you. I guess we're taking eight here. I wish I could flash this in. That would just be great. I would just wipe them off the face of the earth. The face of the earth. Yep, can't do that either at instant speed. Don't have a blocker for this guy, so we have to... Can't really attack it. When does season two of The Boys come out? They finish filming before COVID, right? You got me. That I don't know. So I have no way to deal with the Gidgen. I guess I could block it. Guess I'll die. Guess I will die. <clears throat> well, they're in top deck mode. Like that matters. Matters to me, Michael. It's real to me, damn it. It is real to me. So many two fees. Keep on getting it. Yeah. I mean, we can also go to one here, but that turns off our waterlogged grove. So I'm going to block, kill one, and go to three instead. Who is the best X-Men? Season two is out in July. Good to know. Mm. 
Black Man is out in Black Man. Oh, you trying the six drop. What's wrong with you? Huh? <clears throat> Do you need Jesus? Do I need Jesus? Do I? I'm a fan of Nightcrawler. I don't think he's the best X-Men, but I just kind of like him. Man. Man, oh man. Lost to a Planeswalker again. Shut up. No. Well, you did it anyway, so I guess I win. What? You shut up. You didn't say anything after it, word, so I, I won. But I literally said something right after it. And I'm also talking right now. The only thing you said right after was what? Doesn't mean to shut up. This he was running 20 planeswalkers and two ways to deal with them? Was oh, that true? That's insane. No, well, we have two ways to deal with it in our deck alone. I mean, there's tons of ways to deal with them, but it's just like... It's just like, it's just not... Like, I just have to keep dealing... I have to keep dealing with them or else like, they just take over the game. I think we're just dead here. Like, if we play Tezzeret, make a blocker, we're dead. If we play wins for, for on one dude... We're dead. If we play Languish, we're dead to this. Like, we just, we're just we just dead. Like, we have nothing to do here, so. I mean, you can't regenerate because it's negative counters, right? We could cack. <clears throat> you don't have the mana for that anyway. It doesn't matter. You can't regenerate because it's negative counters? Yeah, like, you can't regenerate from a Languish, right? This isn't counters, but yes, I know. No, you can't. We don't have the mana to do that anyway, so. Right. And even if we did, we'd die to, still gonna die to Gideon, so. We have not won a game, unfortunately. Apparently... When you have to play all the cards you draft, it really puts it a, a little inconsistent. Really puts a hampering on your, on your pampering. <laughs> Give me the big bone, beep beep zip. Yeah, try them. Play it up. I think the problem is like besides Oko, we actually don't have that many super powerful cards. We're just kind of playing like a bunch of mid rangey stuff. That's the whole cube. Yeah, we don't have anything super duper good besides Oka. Like what? As opposed to our opponents, <clears throat> Gideon of the Trials and Garrick Relentless and Savannah Alliance? Yeah, but those add up to like a good synergy, you know? Like what? A good aggressive deck. Garrick Relentless? I don't think that's a really aggressive staple. They didn't play anything else? What the fuck? All right, we'll just keep taking one. I'm gonna get little Caesars because my name is Michael Caesar. <laughs> That's Mr. Michael Caesar to you. Is it? Yes. Give me the big, 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 chicken backs and big, big, big. See, this is just, they're setting us up for the languish. Someone set us up to languish. Here yeah. we do. Why'd you give me a start on these shark teeth, Michael? I didn't. You did. No, you fucking did. You literally told me. You literally... All I did was let you know they exist, and you did the rest, we man. We land and a solemn baby. Baby. Baby, like a chicken from a rose in the box on a grave. You didn't like that? I, I, I really loved it. Now you're going to give me a land and a solemn Chicken in a rose on a box. <laughs> They're gonna counter it, but that's life, you know. Sometimes you get your shit countered. Green white token seems like a viable deck in this cube. Yeah. It's pronounced tokens. I don't mind stealing bread from the mouth of Mucho B. Cause he's going hungry. Frank had no idea <laughs> Sharks had teeth before he told them mutual. It's true. Welcome to the world of teeth, Franklin. Hi, I'll be your host, Mutual B. 
And I'll be introducing you to the wonderful world of teeth. Oh, yeah, big teeth. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, big teeth. Take out a bite out of, take a bite out of crime. Scruff McGruff. 86562. I just made that up. I don't know the zip code anymore. I was going to say, wow, you remember that? No, I didn't. Uh. I don't mind stealing bread from Michael B's head. Because yeah. I can't feed all the Michael B's. He's made. Man, shut up. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, let me guess. You got another? Wow, oh, good for you, man. Good for fucking you. Good times. No, but I got counter no matter what we play. So. No, I don't want to play. Why do, I don't want to play choops when I still have languish in hand because then I'm just gonna have to languish my own choops. Plus, they could just make choops unable to block. And if they play like land hell rider, then we just don't get to do anything with choops. I'd rather just not have guys on board. Yay! Well, the whole time Smokey the Bear was trying to prevent forest fires, it was because he was growing weed out in the boonies. True, it's true. <laughs> Typical. Typical millennial bears. <laughs> <laughs> millennial bears. Get right out of here. Why don't you get out of here? Dream trawler. Okay. That'd be a that'd be a sassy black lady. But I can't feed on the Michael bees. I mean, we're just fucking dead again. This is ridiculous. I can't win any of these games, and it's making me sad. Yeah, he just makes it unblockable, and Chandra's eating me die. Well, no, I kill that, but the Chandra still does. Okay, Boomer Bear. Wow. X is currently three? What? Oh, we need a second green. Got it, got it, got it. So we go to four. Chandra does a twosie. This guy does a two Z and then the Dasher does a does a one Z. Okay, so I think we're just probably dead. Again, planeswalker I can't deal with, so It's like it's a theme. It's like it's a theme. No, don't do that. I'm going hungry. <coughs> Shut up. No. Why wouldn't you why? Why wouldn't you? Why would I? Because it's obnoxious and no one wants to keep hearing you cough, man. That's why. I can't help it, frankly. No. I'm going hungry. I'm going hungry. Yeah. Why do you like this? Because I was born on a Sunday. Chicken Sunday? Yeah. Well, we know one of their cards. I'd rather hear him cough than burp into the mic. Well, he does both, so he's got all the bases covered. No matter what form of bodily noise you dislike, Michael's got you covered. Michael's Bodily Noises Foundation. There you go. There's a foundation. Yeah, well. A whole foundation just for me, huh? Well, it's yours, so, I mean, you know. Sunday, chicken Sunday. What's your favorite Creed song? With arms wide open? No. With arms wide open. Oh, no. Welcome to this place. I'll show you I I heard everything the song with arms wide open. Did you? Yeah. Hmm. Michael is just like a real baby. Yeah, all he does is burp and cough and spit up. <laughs> so, 
Oh, happy birthday, Moochel. Guys, can we get a happy some happy birthdays in the chat? It is Mike's birthday today. We haven't said anything, but oh, for of course they hit Magma Jet. That's hilarious. Just want to wish Michael B a happy birthday. It is Michael B's birthday today. And uh I just hope he has a good one, you know. This is amazing. I can't feed on the Michael B's. What if Nickelback did a concert where they just ran through all their songs as one big song? That'd be pretty impressive, actually. Just nonstop songs. One big song? Going for my first trophy. Hey, Golden Goose. Knock it out. Better luck than ours. What if they did a concert where they just played all of their songs at the same exact time? And it just sounded like one it all song. sounds the same, yeah. And then it summoned Me Mega Nickelback. <laughs> Mega Nickelback. Wow. With your Nickelback songs combined. I got my first trophy years ago. It wasn't for Magic. What was it for? That's funny because it's Michael Barbable for his birthday too. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Kerwin, that was my point. Oh. All right, guys, are you ready to lose one more one more game and not uh, not win a game? I think you can do it. You can get there. I believe in myself. I'm gonna take some more uh, some Advil after this or Tylenol. My head's banging. Your head's banging. Yeah. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Pizza for Mike BBB Day. The extra B stands for bring your own BB. What? <laughs> God damn. Fancy art. Thank you so much for the donation, buddy. Really appreciate it. Shut up and take my money. Look at the graph bug. <laughs> One look at the graph bug. Look at this graph. Is anyone familiar with MTG Forge? I have no idea what that is. Ten Michael B. Pizza Bucks. That's a first. Uh, okay. Okay. I'm in. Okay. Excuse me. Let's go get that teamer triome. Catch ya. Here comes old Goblin Guido. Every game. If you don't give me a land, I swear to Jesus. Oh my god, a five mana Tesseret. And I swear to Jesus in the sky every day. He'll be there. <laughs> you swear to Jesus that he'll be there? That's like me being like, Michael, I swear that you'll be there. <laughs> That's really weird. That's kind of a weird thing. You think I'm trying to make sense, man? Yeah, I mean, I assume. Wrong. Okay. <laughs> For better or worse, kill chicken, do part. I love Jesus with all of my farts. <laughs> Amen. I think he's literally having a fucking <laughs> brain meltdown right now. And I swear. Why do you mix an I swear with some Jesus lyrics? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, is this guy coming at me? Be weird if he wasn't. Joke's on you. I'm gonna eat him. Yum yum, eat him up. Are you ready? Jesus, can you stop making noises for like five seconds, bro? It's just mono burps and fucking coughs and sniffles and chews. When's the last time I chewed on the mic? top notes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that idea. Mm, vanilla. Oh, boy. That is a good one. All right, let's do this guy. Make a food arena.
So in tasting, what we do is take a small amount right off the top. It doesn't take much. That's the warmest part right here. I'm going to invert the spoon. Mm. Cover all 9,000 taste buds. Aerate it. Warm it up. Driving up that top note, that cream, pure vanilla, sweeteners. Mm. That's a 10. It's like a fucking lizard. So <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Oh, guys sneeze. Oh, fucking die. Oh, we can Another one for the platinum album. I should make a cover album. How much for a mukbang snip? It's going to be about tree fitty. It's about tree fitty. Create a food token. Every day is food day. Mm. Top notes. Warm it up. <laughs> Warm it up. I just want to kill it. Good. Kill it. Excellent. Put it in the trash can. Put it in the dumpster. Yes. Attack Oko. Man, attacking Oko with a 1-1 one -one is such a losing battle. It, it literally, feels like shit. It literally does nothing. And even if you attack him, like if he attacks you, you just have six life on board, so it also doesn't matter. And every turn you make three more potential life. Oh, wow. Actually, I'm I'm on, almost at a point where I can draw two from this guy. Yep. Fly me to <laughs> the moon. Cream, pure vanilla, sweeteners. Mm, that's a ten. Mmm, that's a ten. Such a weird video, man. It's a good one. Mmm, that's a ten. Why did he say he was wearing the spoon? I don't know. Some weird stuff. I don't know, man. What am I, scientist? What am I, ice cream scientist? Probably because you you want the ice cream to hit your tongue, not the spoon. Even though I'm pretty sure they use gold spoons because they're the least taste. Uh, they have the least taste. Shut up and take my money. Oh. One tiny bites bug. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Having a good time. Having a good time. You ever having a good time, Michael? No. I ain't never had that. It. It's too bad. Look at all the artifacts we got now. I count about at least four. It's only three, so I don't know how you're counting at least four. You're saying there's only three artifacts on board? That's correct. Are you sure about that? I am 100% positive, yes. Oh, because you turned into an elk. I got you. You figured it out. You made it. Having a good time. You're still an artifact in spirit. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a 10. Warm it up. He has to get the ice cream straight onto all those taste buds. It's true. Hey, man, you want to invest in gold silverware so we can be fancy? No. But also, fuck yeah. <laughs> I was like, he's going to say yes. Top notes. Your food is green. You should throw it out. Hmm, good point. No, when you're in the wild, you got to eat whatever kind of food you can get. This dude's an 11 loyalty. Like, it's just the most unfun, miserable bullshit card to play against. I swear to God, R and D did never never activated an ability on this card before. Also, if they it. ever got something insane, you can either just turn it into an elk, or you can exchange one of your foods <laughs> and get it for you. So good luck. <sighs> Oka's really an enchantment on a plane's order? Yeah, because you can never. Won't kill buy it. golden utensils, but instead wants a damn tooth. <laughs> it's true. 
Yeah, but how much cooler is a dinosaur tooth than a spoon? You know? I just want to get di- enough dinosaur teeth to use as my utensils, and then I'll just eat with them. This is my megalodon spoon. Yeah, I'll just put a handle on the end of the tooth, and then I'll just eat with that. I feel like you guys aren't thinking. <laughs> just use the shark tooth as a plate. They're not that big. It's only five inches, man. I just want my food to resolve. Today, Junior! Oh, it did. See, it worked. Wow, the meme worked. Let's draw two cards. Okay. Aya Exepa. That's once upon a time here. Let's see what we get. Get a solid gold Megalodon tooth. Wow. Fuck, I'll get it bronzed. That seems like it would decrease its value. You put a handle on the tooth? You can't handle the tooth. Okay, that shit's funny. See, that's a goddamn... What cards are better than Oko and Magic? Lotus and all the Moxes, Ancestral, and what else? That's the end of the list. (laughs) I don't understand what you're asking. That is where the list ends. Oh, what up, Badger? Welcome back, my dude. What time is it there? It's got to be like 2 a.m., right? I don't think we're attacking. Oh, sure, Soaring. Sure. Lurus only in certain formats, though. Yeah, I think if you have a choice between Oko and, and Lurus and Modern, you're just taking Oko. Same thing in Pioneer. I would disagree with Bizarre. Bizarre's only good in Dredge. No, Bizarre is trash. Workshops, maybe. If a card goes into literally every archetype and you can splash just to play it, whereas if a, if a card only goes into one very specific archetype, the one that goes into every archetype is better all the time yeah all around yeah and we're talking about Ogo none of those cards are win condition though yeah but like being a win condition doesn't necessarily fascinating equivalent power equivalent yeah so we're taking three but if we dismember this we take four so I'm just gonna dismember it and take the four go to five assume they don't have two spells that can kill me in hand and then next turn make two foods so that's that's gonna be my goal here okay we're all fooded up food it up boo. also if you just leave mana open they can never kill you with burn so just leave two mana open you yeah you know why cause Oko <laughs> yeah he know Joko force or manager might be other than Oko no way what not even close those are just counter spells dude one of them, no, the, the, when a card single-handedly wins the game, like, force that you know one's ever won the game with a force of will. They prevent himself from losing. Right, but that's a completely different thing. Also, force, you have to pitch a card, so, like, and pay life. There's a lot of times when force is actually bad. And mana drain only gives you colorless mana, so sometimes it's not even that great. You can definitely win the game with Mandrain. Yeah, but you have to have something to support it. Like, Oko doesn't need any support other than self. Right. If you cast Oko, you can win the game by literally never casting another card again. Literally. Force is bad in any fair format. That's true, yeah. In formats where it's fair, Force is generally not that great. Does Mike live in a bazaar? You know he does. Wow. Boy, you know he do. Oh yeah, Ogo is terrible. Like a terrible design mm-hmm. card. It's not fun to play against. Uh, it makes the game slow and annoying. Like <laughs> oh, that's gonna be a good clip. <laughs> oh god. Rats versus lobsters, and the lobsters had like little, little spacesuits for water. <laughs> spacesuits? Yeah, so they could breathe on land. <laughs> and then I think it would be a good match. Guys, they called them spacesuits for water. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what else to say. <laughs> it's not really a thing, so. Because I thought you meant like, like a spacesuit that you wear in water instead of space. Oh. And I was like, that's just like a scuba suit, man. 
It's been 11 weeks of quarantine. It's been 11 weeks since the quarantine. Don't have COVID-19. <laughs> How has it been 11 weeks of Bortina? Wow. You know, I almost said that myself. But you didn't. But you didn't. But it'll still be two weeks till Mike says he's sorry. Cards that can single handedly soon a game are fine. Having them cause three is not right. I agree with you. Speaking of Bortina, where is Katie? She is getting pizza with her roommate. Speaking of Mike B. Where is Mike B? <coughs> oh, where, oh, where could Mike B be? Oh, where, oh, where could Mike B? Pure vanilla. Sweeteners. Mm, that's a 10. <sighs> that's a 10, Michael. 10. Mm -hmm. Does our opponent concede? Did he just leave? Is he gone? Don't you know Mike B isn't real? I don't know. I think we mulligan this hand. Yeah, okay. Jolene! Jolene! If we can go turn four questing and turn five Hawatli and gain four every turn, that seems pretty good. So, like, a stomping ground would be the good land? Or that... Teamer Ket Teamer Teamer Triome. That guy sounds like he's got a tiny mouth. Can you run the Tiny Bites video at slow speed? Oh fuck. Yes. So in tasting I don't know why I can't pop it out though. Pop it out. Yeah, it's weird. Some pop videos it out, just can't. Pop it out, pop it out. Do you hear that hunter? He's like, arr, arr, arr. well, this is nice because it's a red and a green. I think the clear best card is surgical. I've literally never seen it not be suggested as a good cyborg choice for every matchup ever by Twitch. <laughs> yeah, surgical is eh, it's not that great. A lot of times, boarding in cards like surgical are actually really bad. All right, Kerwin, you want fifty percent? What we do is take a small amount right off the top. Oh gosh. It doesn't take much. That's the warmest part right here. I'm going to invert the spoon. Mm. Cover all 9,000 taste buds. Aerate it, oh, warm cool. it up, driving up that top milk, that cream, pure vanilla, <laughs> sweeteners. Mm. That's a 10. That's a 10. That was amazing. Hua. <laughs> okay, a lot of options here. We can try the questing beast. I feel like they have another counter spell because they're not playing anything. We could also just incendiary flow this idiot. Okay, well maybe they don't have anything. Feels like they may have F6'd. Can it go slower than that? Wow. Yes, actually. Funny you asked. Let's go. 
So when tasting, what we do is take a small amount right off the top. It doesn't take much. Yes, I had a wound. That's the warmest part right here. I'm going to invert the spoon. It just sounds drunk. Taking all the ketamine. Sure. Okay. <laughs> that sounds so Warm disgusting. So. Driving up. Language. Not the same. That top note. That cream. <laughs> Pure <laughs> vanilla. <laughs> oh, Jesus. It reminds me so much of this. Oh, no. Sweetness. <laughs> Sweetness. Oh god, I'm done. Alright, I think we're dead again because they just attack with Glorybringer, they're able to kill this and Questing Beast. This video sounds like what playing Oko feels like. That sounds correct. God, Glorybringer's also... If we can't take the Glorybringer, they just get it right back immediately. Oh god, 125%? Kerwin, come on, man. This but, is the last time we're doing this. But yes, I can. So in tasting, what we do is take a small amount right <laughs> off the top. It doesn't take much. That's the warmest part right here. I'm going to invert the spoon. Mm. Cover all 9,000 taste buds. Aerate it. Warm it up. Driving up that top milk. That cream. Pure vanilla. <laughs> Sweetener. I think it's actually better when it's faster because the it's funnier. We can go one, we can go two times as fast. So in tasting, what we do is take a small amount right off the top. It doesn't take much. That's the warmest part right here. I'm gonna invert the spoon. Cover all nine thousand taste buds. Area, warm it up. Grabbing up that top note. That cream, pure vanilla, sweetener. That's a ten. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. I think it's better faster. God damn. Yeah, because it's less of a nightmare. Oh, Jesus. Have you ever had a dream 25% now? Oh, God. Do -do -do -do. <sighs> okay. Oh, so you're going at my face. And Hwadi McWadi. Okay. Hwadi McWadi. Hwadi McWadi. Hmm. This is weird that they didn't choose to kill the Hwali here. It's 
Nope, need double blue there. All right, cancel. Are we coming back? This is wild. Sylvan Library next turn is bonkers good. This guy doesn't untap, so we have like another turn to figure out an answer. <laughs> Crack that tarn. Crack that tarn. Bam. Nope, you got it. Do you just insta bring that dude back? Sure. Do you kill Hawali here? Put me dead on board to the Glorbringer? Yeah, you have to, right? Yeah, you already made it you already made the mistake once. Don't make it again, dude. This member is nice. Council's judgment and nice. Uh, put on top and put on top. Doodly do do do. Don't call it a comeback. My name is Michael B. I live in the trash can under the sea. I guess I'll block. Oh, they didn't even, they didn't even waste their time. <clears throat> so now we're just living in the old Sylvan Library world. Thank you! MTG Pyro, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it, my dude. Welcome back. Let's get a white. Hey, little chicken man. I don't think there's any creature that they can attack with for six that kills us. Are we ever going to see regenerate in a set again? I'm pretty sure, yeah. Did they announce they weren't doing that anymore or something? I'm not sure. Magic's hard. Well, I guess they get to attack us for one. Put us to fivers. But we I get three, on it. three new cards here, so that's pretty nice. I got fives on it. Yep, and let's see what happens. That's not... Great. What does this guy cost? Five. One, two, three, four, five. Can't cycle here. Guess we're just playing this guy from the graveyard. Hold on, dude. Uh, one, two, three, four. Regenerate is a 10 on the storm scale, which is Mark Roser saying he doesn't think so, but things can change. The storm scale? What the fuck does that mean? They're saying it's a 10 power, because that does not seem right at all. Like, Regenerate usually costs mana, and there's things that exile, like, I don't know. I don't think it's a power scale. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, I don't want to play that. Plus, I don't see me getting rid of the Hexproof, but I think it's much worse. The Storm Scale is how likely is the mechanic to return to standard? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty bad.
They are making hex proof cost a lot now. We'll see. Man, Mr. Confluence really messing us up right now. It's pretty good. All right. Vorapede. Lose to this. So we're basically. No, we need pacifism here. It sucks because I don't want to like. We'll go to one, unless they have counterspell. Oh, how good. Get rid of one of them threats. And they put it on the bottom, okay. Maybe sack the sower too, just uh, for funsies. Probably should have. Oh, Excel, what's up, my dude? Really, you think they should have, huh? So then we get our guy back. Cool. All right. And O, O three, unfortunately. Primaris Powerhouse. Thank you so much for the support. Either way, I really game. appreciate it, man. We want a game. We want one too. Oh. Can't even pay attention. It's unbelievable. It Thank like it's you guys for watching. Me. Slam those like and subscribe button. Check me out on twitch.tv slash franklapore. Manitraders.com slash franklapore. That's not true. Manitraders.com. Link and promo code are down below. 20% off the first three months of any subscription uh, with the link and promo code down below. It's a great subscription service. Tons and tons of people have been using it with my link and promo code. It's a great way to help the stream out. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Slam those things. I'll see you later.